Yo, what is up everybody? It is your boy Static Shy and we are back here with another YouTube video and today we are going to be doing a trailer reaction for The Flash. It's the first look teaser trailer it says from the DC fandom. As I said in my previous videos, I'm extremely late with all these trailers. Like the only trailer reaction I gave you guys was the Batman official trailer too. So now I'm taking a look to see what The Flash is looking like. And I'm also going to be taking a look at Black Adam eventually, and so on and so forth. So without further ado, we're going to get started. But don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hoax smash that bell button for more content. Let's get straight into this. Greetings, DC fandom and dumbers. Ezra Miller here, live from the set of The Flash. It looks like this. We're very excited to show you the movie. Uh, and we can't yet because we're still making it. We wanted to show you a teaser, but we can't because we don't have enough material to make a teaser yet. We, we can't make a trailer. Uh, but we do have this small sneak peek that my maestro Andy and I have put together that we really hope you'll enjoy. And I will see you in theaters later next year, or more importantly, you will see me. Tell me something. You can go anywhere you want, right? Any timeline, any universe. Yo, super sick! Why do you want to stay and fight to save this one? You change the future. And you change the past. Are you in? Is that the Michael Keaton? Come on! Yo! Nah, hold up! Hold up! Yo! That video was only a minute and 57 seconds. We'll give it like basically two minutes. And the first part of it was just Ezra Miller just talking about just basically being weird about this whole thing. Like, oh, I can't give you guys too much, yada, yada, yada. But, yo, we got a lot in that. Now, this trailer, boy, y'all over here probably like, yo, Static, why are you over here over-exaggerated, getting mad excited over that little bit of stuff? Nah, that's a lot right there because they went back. Like... That's Michael Keaton's Batman right there. This is a Flashpoint movie. I, it's not no ordinary Flash movie we get in. That's my assumption right there. And I'm still a little like confused about like the whole three Flash thing right there. That took me out, I'm like, huh? But we're gonna see what it's about and stuff and how everything's gonna turn out. Nah, though, that, yo, his suit looks sick. Sick. Yo, they got it. They got it for this one. I wish we would have saw the Batmobile. I, yo, ooh, I'm so mad. I'm not trying to be too loud because, you know, my brother, he's going to throw a whole fit. But, yo, that was fire. Like, that really was fire, man. We about to get that movie is gonna be great. When did it it's coming out? Did he even say? Nah, nah, I don't think so. Yo. <sighs> nah, I'm sorry. Like that already. Yo, my heart right now. Cause that suit is really sick. That looks mad realistic. Like they just look like they really DC. I saw this post on Facebook. And it said it just showed the Batman. It's a meme. It said the it shows Batman 
and then it was like a bunch of Marvel movies on the bottom. And they said, this is what quality looks like versus quantity. And I'm not even gonna lie, DC got it, DC got it this time. Marvel is just putting out stuff now. Like they just putting it out just to put it out. Like we're, they're just giving us mad stuff and it's not even like quality content. DC, now they're doing now they're doing the right things. They're taking their time with this stuff. And that's why we that's why people are getting more excited with DC than they are with Marvel right now. Because we're like, yo, Marvel, what are you doing? Like Marvel before they were taking their time and that's how things was going. Like they were giving us they were giving us a lot of movies, but the quality was up there over the quantity. At DC, they were just throwing stuff at us at the time. Now they look like they really re-examining things, taking their time, and just looking into it. So far, the official trailer for Batman 2, that, like I said, you know, in my uh, trailer reaction, I like the first trailer better than the second one, but it's still doing it for me. Like, I still love it. I still can't wait to see it. As for The Flash, A+. plus. Both both Batman, the Batman trailer and the Flash trailer got an A+, plus for me. They got it. That's a 10 out of 10. And we only got two minutes. That's a teaser right there. Imagine what the real trailer is going to be like when we get more. We get more dialogue, excuse me, and everything. That's sick. Like, yo, I'm, y'all don't understand, yo. I'm mad excited for this. Mad excited. But it also looked as if that was um from the CW Flash. Like, the when he looked, like, when he uh, was in the street, that looked like that was his home and stuff. But that's just assumptions. We don't know for sure until the movie drops. These are just rumors. Do not believe everything everybody says. Wait till the movie drops and you'll see for yourself. Or unless, like, DC, Warner Bros, or an actor or actress actually confirms it themselves, then yeah. So that's it for that. Stay tuned for my Black Adam trailer reaction. Also, look like there's another, there's a Suicide Squad new trailer and there's a new Gotham Nice trailer. So stay tuned for those as well, guys. Peace out, guys. To the next video. I hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hope smash that bell button for more content. To the next video. Boom, let's go. Real quick, I actually made a mistake in the video. That wasn't three flashes that we saw. That was actually Supergirl, the flash, the other person I couldn't really see. But yeah, just to, you know, correct that. I reviewed the trailer again because that trailer is just too hot. But peace out, guys. Just wanted to, you know, make up for that error.